ang pag-ibig ni Kristo ay ang pag-ibig na ating nakikita sa krus. At itong pag-ibig na ito ay may tatlong katangian. Sa itong pag-ibig na walang hanggan. Ikalawa, sa itong pag-ibig na walang kondisyon. At pangatlo, isa itong pag-ibig na nagsasakripisyo. Emma, you have lengthened my patience and built trust. One time, we have an out of town. And again, you came late. I know that you know na I am not okay. Sa tagal ng biyahe, you noticed na gutom. Oh, remember? Then you gave me a burger and fries from your bag. Telling me kasi alam mo, alam ko magugutom ka sa sakit ng ulo mo. Sorry, late ako kasi bumili pa ako ng burger and fries for you. You made me realize that day that you always have your reason. And that reason is me. You are the most kind, caring, generous, and loving person I have ever met. For 11 years of our relationship, I felt comfort, I felt the care, I felt the love, and you are consistent. si Allen, eh si Emma nasaan? Kasi I have my daughter with me. Sabi niya, ay, ando nagbabantay si Emma sa kay Aline, yung daughter ko. Ay, sabi ko, gusto ko na siya. <laughs> Kasi no, because if somebody cares for a person who she does not know, what more yung care niya dun sa loved ones niya. So, sabi ko sa kanya, di ba? Sabi ko sa'yo, ay, gusto ko na siya. Gusto na namin siya forever. So, yeah. Hi, Allen. Thank you. Thank you. Evelyn, to be my wife. To be my wife. I promise. I promise. To be faithful to you. To be faithful to you. In good times. And in bad. And in bad. In sickness. And in health. And in health. To love you. To love you. And to honor you. And to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Open ba yan? Oh my gosh! Iphone 12! Thank you so much! Ay! Open to me! Yung pala hindi pa ko siya. Thank you! Talaga hindi yan nag-boyfriend hanggang hindi siya nakatapos ng kanyang pag-aaral. Nung matatapos naman siya ng college, nag-text siya sa amin, Papa, Mama, Kuya, may boyfriend na ako. Nung ako noon, not to commit into a relationship until such time na makagraduate ng college. But since I have a promise not to be in a relationship until I graduated, I waited for another four years. That's the time when I started believing in destiny. That if we're meant to be, God will make a way. In that four years, I always prayed for you and our good Lord has never failed me. He answered my prayer. We met again at a very special place. It was inside McLaren Church. Back then, I prayed silently and told God that the person beside me is the one that I am going to marry and spend the rest of my life with. 
And here I am today, standing in front of you, finally fulfilling that prayer of Mary. Sa inyong pagpapakasal ngayon, inalay ninyo ang inyong buong buhay sa isang taong pinakamamahal ninyo sa hirap at sa ginhawa, kagaya ng pagmamahal ni Kristo. Evelyn, did you come here of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your husband? Yes, Father. How to take good care of you, protect you, raise a good family, and grow old with you. He's your first boyfriend, your best friend, your travel buddy, your husband. I vow to you that having me as your partner in life is worthwhile. <laughs> 